Hey there, it's Tina. I want to share something with you that I make for a lot of my clients to help them move through tasks and activities more independently. One request that I get a lot from parents of children with and without disabilities is to teach their children how to independently start, finish, complete tasks, and then start a new task. And so this is a really easy way, using things that you probably have around your house, to get your kids to start things without having to ask you what they should do, tell you that they're bored, ask you to do something with them. And I think this can be really helpful now that we're all stuck inside and trying to find things to stay busy. And many of us are still trying to work from home while we have children at home. So this is a way that you can have a little bit of structure and routine without a rigid schedule and without having to dictate the day for your kids. Um, so let me turn this around and show you what I've made. So the only things you need to create these activity schedules are some clothespins or paper clips and a Sharpie to write with or any marker that will write on them and some cups or some bowls. So what I do is I write the activities on either the clothespins or the popsicle sticks and we put them around or put them in. And for some of them, I put time limits on them. So here's the iPad for 10 minutes. And here's a book. Here's a puzzle. And so you can set this up at the beginning of the day. You could set this up at multiple times throughout the day. And if there's certain things that you want to limit access to, like let's say going outside isn't an option right now, then you can take one away. Or if you want to give some extra play time um, or extra more preferred activities you could put on two iPad clothespins or two TV clothespins um, but you can set this up you could set this up with your child so that they know what's expected and then once they finish going through each of these activities then they could come to you and say okay I've done everything and now I need something else to do this can also be used for chores it can be used for morning routines it can be used for homework um, it can be used to mix and vary work with reinforcement. So once you teach this activity schedule, you can really use it for any kind of activities. You could even take it with you um, if you were going on vacation or a long car trip or you were going to a restaurant and you needed your kids to be a little bit more independent. 